Today we are going to fix League of Legends VC runtime 140 underscore one dot DNL was not found problem. The solution consists of two very very simple steps. The first step is to download the DNL file and place it in the missing locations. To download the DNL file, we open a browser and click on the website where we can download it from. And for that website, the link is mentioned in the description box. Once the site is open, we scroll down and click on download. Now we need to place the download DLL file in system32 and syswow64. To find these files, we click on local disk C. Then we click on the windows folder. To find, we press the S key. We have found the files here. Now we will put the missing DLL file in these files. To do this, we right click on the DLL file and click on copy and then we double click on syswow64. We paste the copied DLL file here. To continue, we click on continue. We will do the same process for system32 as well. We right click and paste the DLL file in system32. To continue, we click on replace the file with the destination and then we click on continue. That was our first step. Now our second step is to download Microsoft Visual Studio C++ and DirectX. To do this, we open a browser and click on Microsoft website. I will put the link of this site in the description box again. Once this site is open, we scroll down. x86 is for 32-bit systems and x64 is for 64-bit systems. We download the one that is suitable for our system. Now once it is downloaded and the download is complete, we click on the setup file. We click run to continue. Now we click on repair or install. We have downloaded Microsoft Visual Studio C++. Now we download DirectX. To do this, we open a browser again. Now once the site is open, scroll down and select your language. After doing this, click download. Now click on the setup file. Then we tick I accept the agreement and click next. We uncheck install the Bing bar and click next. The installation process is now complete and we have to click finish. You just now need to restart your computer and after doing this, you can check if the problem is solved or not. We hope we could have resolved your problem and for more such videos, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.